An event today brought together employees from Gale, an educational publishing company, and dozens of kids from the Detroit Public Library's summer reading and math program. It was organized by a group of interns at the company. As Coco McAvoy is about to show us, both parties were in for a pretty big surprise. Remove plastic cap. Some models have one piece handlebar. The model is a reflector. Make sure it's above the mini mark. The employees from Gale are hard at work. That's the reflector. Oh. That's the back one. All right, so make sure it's above the mini mark. Carefully crafting bicycles. Why don't we use the wrench? Making sure they're just right. Feel yeah, like we're missing. Feel something. like we're missing. Tighten the seat clamp. Julia Furta and Ashley Pattarello believe their labor will benefit the greater good without being able to fully picture just how yet. They haven't shared that bit of information yet. That's a surprise to come later this afternoon. Though they can imagine. It's uh, fun to think about the little girl who might be riding this bike for the first time and enjoying herself. They won't be waiting much longer. These buses just pulled up loaded with kids. Come on kids, come on out and yeah. These kids have no idea that on the other side of this building and here they are. Is a big surprise. The rightful owners to these handcrafted bikes are now 50 kids from the Detroit Public Library's summer reading and math program. Oh, what do you think of your bike? Nice. The pretty and pink bike Furta and Patarello helped build now belongs to three-year-old Caitlin. Watching a little kid get on the bike and ride around our Gale parking lot really empowers everything that we're doing. The excitement is twofold. She just thought it was a, just a regular field trip nothing special. So she's very happy. The kids are adjusting to their new bikes. I have to grow. You do? I think you grew enough. That's why you got this bike. It's just your size. And the employees at Gale are now able to visualize who benefits from their hard work and the good it will bring to a neighboring community of kids. Coco McAvoy, Local 4. So cute, that little one kid thinking, I have to grow a little bit. I just love the reaction. I mean, it's Christmas morning there in an instant for 50 kids. Yeah, absolutely. So cool. Well, actually, the general manager, Paul Gazzolo, says he hopes the kids who received bikes today will come back to the company as interns once they get to college, which would be great and bring it all full circle. Full circle. I love it. Yeah, yeah that's fantastic.